how we will install a Windows subsystem for Linux and why. If you have if you have issues uh, using Google Collab for our uh, hand-ons and workshop, you can uh, install a, a version to work on Spark locally on your local machine. So, what is the best way? The best way is to install uh, a Linux environment. If you have Windows 10, one of the easiest way to install Linux. Uh, near your Windows 10 is to install Windows Subsystem for Linux. This will allow you to uh, to install easily an Ubuntu version on your Windows 10 and in Ubuntu we will install Python, Spark, Java and Jupyter. So how we can start by installing WSL? The, the easiest way is to come here down on your screen. There is start, you see it. And after there is a uh, search near, you, you put search and turn, you type turn, turn, you will have turn windows features on and off. You choose window features on and off. And here are all the feature possible and down somewhere you have Windows subsystem for Linux. You choose it and you click OK and you will install it. The other way, if you don't like to click on many menus, the other way is to do it in a PowerShell administrator uh, terminal. So the same thing, you, we come here, we put PowerShell I will have everything <coughs> here is PowerShell you verify that you will run PowerShell as an administrator so I make run as administrator so he asked me are you sure you want to uh, launch it as an administrator I say yes and now here I have these two simple command I copy paste them you will go to my page of the workshop, BDML, like Big Data Machine Learning, the, uh, minus spark dot dot lb, and you go to lab environment, you will have this page. So on this page, you will have all the steps that needed to install Spark on your uh, local uh, computer. So you just copy paste this, I copy, I go to my uh, PowerShell as admin and I click, you click the right button on your mouse, you copy from the uh, Windows and you click on the right button on the PowerShell, he will uh, do uh, these things. So we install two features, Virtual Machine Platform and Microsoft Windows Subsystem. What I do there uh, in the uh, Windows. And now it's OK. Normally, you will have to restart your computer. Okay? Before uh, restarting, you can try. It depends on your uh, version of uh, Windows. You can try to set the default version of WSL to 2. Normally it will be uh, 1. So uh, sometime it's possible, sometime not. Why? It depends on your version of Windows 10. Here I will show you my version of Windows 10. I come here to System, System About. And here you see I have the Windows 10 Enterprise version 20.04. So perhaps uh, in version before 20.04, you will not be able to put the version 2 of WSL. It's not an issue. So after that, you restart.
our download is finished it took half an hour approximately so uh, we will uh, launch it for the first time you can launch it from here because you stay on the windows store but if you leave the windows store because the download is too long you can find it again here you just put ubuntu and you will see it here so you will launch it for the first time so you will try to install uh, stuffs for the first time so you will create a user a password so here first username i ask you to use the same for all of us bdml so if the username is bdml you put the password you wish you retype your password and we are ready to work with ubuntu so one of the things you can do to launch it quickly each time is to pin it on the uh, here you pin it to the taskbar so here down you will always have a uh, ubuntu uh, icon to launch uh, quickly your uh, ubuntu so we are ready i close it i try it again so i am here after that i stop now we will install the uh, missing uh, softwares as i told you java python git in python jupyter lab and spark of course all of this in the next video if uh, you are using or you decide to use google collab all these install are not necessary but i advise you to do it because if you want to re to achieve some real projects or some real softwares uh, based on machine learning you will need a development environment this will be your development environment of course the execution environment the uh, the operational uh, environment cannot be a local machine it's useless to use a spark on one machine spark need a cluster of machine of cheap machine of not so powerful machine but it need a cluster of machine so in general you will put them in the cloud if you have a real usage of uh, this machine learning and data mining uh, applications or in your uh, 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 environment local environment with a, uh, a small uh, data center and uh, calculus center for uh, your activities so see you in the next lectures